the other thing I saw that I thought, ooh, slightly controversial in 2024 was that there were different exhibitors doing like diet pills and diet systems. And, you know, as, as a Westerner, that kind of thing always kind of shocks me a little bit because the dialogue and conversation that people are having in Western countries like the US, Canada and Australia at the moment, particularly around, you know, any kind of dieting, uh, commenting on people's weight, their body, all of that sort of stuff is like very different to the kinds of conversations that people are having in Korea. So it suffice it to say that this is still a huge part of the market here in Korea. It is very popular. A lot of celebrities and idols will promote what I think is honestly pretty extreme diet culture. Uh, and there's just seemingly not the same awareness of the danger or maybe the fact that we don't want to be having those conversations, you know, to the point where people will, uh, you know, discuss exactly how much they weigh, how much weight they lost. Uh, and often people are losing like not a whole lot of weight and telling you like how they did it. And it's like, is that all the weight that they had to lose? Like, this is not, you know, this is not rocket science to figure out how you would lose three kilos. Like, but the me the means and the methods and stuff like that that people go to to do it are not always uh, the most sane, healthy or um, probably good for your long-term health ways to do it.